guys, what's up? It's Kinsey and welcome back to my channel. I am very excited to be doing more of a like styling, lifestyle, beauty, fashion type video, like sit down, you know what I mean? If you guys are new here, I do a lot of vlogs, I do a lot of lifestyle videos and I've been really wanting to get back into making better content for you guys. I've been inspired lately. So if you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. I live in Dallas, Texas. Comment down below where you guys are from or where you're living right now. <laughs> my hands, let's just, uh, it's fine, seriously, it's fine. There are bigger problems in the world right now, you know? Okay, but seriously, it is so hot outside. Like, it is absolutely miserable right now. I hate the heat. Like, I would much rather be freezing and bundled up. And I also lose all energy and motivation to wear anything cute at this time because I just feel so disgusting. So I decided to put together some outfits, some looks, some of my go-to pieces for when it is so hot outside. I definitely have a large wish list of things that I want to buy, but I haven't. So that this video would probably be better with those things. But I'm gonna show you guys what I already have in my closet and what I've been wearing in order to, uh, you know, survive this heat. It is awful. I'm gonna be showing you guys these pieces, styling them, and then linking them all down below. So if you guys want to shop any of these pieces, there's just direct links with everything. I'll also mention my sizes and stuff. So basically, I'll either wear like loose fitted dresses, tank top, shorts, which I don't love denim shorts. I don't feel like anyone does, but I have two pairs of denim shorts that are bomb. So I will show you guys those. Loose fitted dresses, tank top. Oh, athleisure wear, guys. If you just make it look you're going to work out, no one cares what you're wearing. No one knows if you're going to the gym after or not. And like, quite frankly, who cares? You know what I mean? Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys some loose fitted dresses that I have. I have a lot of dresses and I still need so many more, but a good loose fitted dress is what we need in times like this. I have this one that kind of looks like I am like a elementary school teacher slash it's Easter. It's from Lou and Gray. It's not something I would typically go for. The only word that I can think of Right now is darling, and like I don't use that word, but that's how I would describe this dress, you know what I mean? Again, loose fitted, um, dresses are really, really easy. It's You literally put on one item of clothing and your outfit is like set. Um, also, it kind of just feels like you're not wearing clothes, you know? These are just so soft. This one is from Princess Polly. This is in a size medium, but just a short, again, flowy dress. If you sweat, like you won't be able to see, so that's great. But again, it's super loose, super light. It's not gonna make you feel like horrible. Even with some dresses that are just thick and too close to you, I'm like, ooh. Okay, I think this dress is so cute. You can pair it with a pair of like white sneakers, white sandals, white docks. I love that. This is from Misguided. It's super cute, like definitely like conservative looking almost, but I think it can be styled really fun. Also, it's long, so if you haven't like shaved your legs or like your self tanner's messed up or something, it covers it, you know? I'm like, not that I would like know that life, but. Okay, and then I have this dress, guys. I know so many girls with like a larger chest probably feel my pain, but like, I hate how I feel like my boobs are like out in this. Like I wish that I need to, I literally need to start a clothing line that has cute summer dresses where I don't feel like my like, my like chest is falling all over the place. I just feel so awkward. Like I feel really uncomfortable. This dress though is very, very cute. I got it in a size four. So maybe if I got a size six, it would help. Um, but again, just like a long, beautiful, beautiful dress. All right guys, so I know that we probably all hate denim shorts and I'm here to save the day with two of the best denim short wrecks ever. The first pair are definitely less expensive in comparison to the next. They're from Topshop. I got these in a size six. I wish I would have gotten a size four just because they stretch out a little bit and they are just like a little bit big to begin with, but at the same time, they're cute because it gives you that kind of like baggy look. So it's really whatever you want. I just think as far as like comfort and feeling like I'm like always pulling my shorts up, I would have sized down one and just gotten a size four. For reference, I would say I'm typically more of a size six, but I can sometimes go down to a four, just really depends. Just so cute. I love how they're long. I prefer a little bit longer of a cut because I feel like it is more flattering on my leg, but Anyways, these are so cute. It has the slits right here. Obviously, as you can see, they're so comfortable. I do not wear denim shorts. I don't like them. I don't like the way that I feel in them. I normally, I honestly like, don't love the way that they look normally. And these are the best. I am so glad I bought them. I will have them linked down below. Again, they're so soft. Like coming from a girl who does not like denim shorts, these are gonna be your best friend. The price point is a lot friendlier on these in comparison to the ones that are coming. So. These are it. And then if you are down to maybe splurge a little bit more, um, maybe you have some like girlfriend credit or something like that, or you're just like a big denim person, I would really recommend these girlfriend jeans. I had my grandma taking a bunch of denim for me 
So she took these in. So I got them in a size 28, which is too big. Again, I am normally a size like 27 or 28. So these have been taken in. That means anything to you. I don't have an actual size to give you, so I'm sorry, but they are just so great. These definitely feel a little bit more like actual denim. The Topshop ones are softer. These are still really comfortable. I love the fit. I think they're really flattering. I love, I love how it kind of hugs the leg in all the right parts, but it's just, I don't know. I just think that these are truly the best. I love them. Um, yeah, they're girlfriend. I love girlfriend denim, guys. Like, I have my favorite jeans. They're always from there. And yeah, I don't know. For me personally, jeans in maybe one good pair of shorts just because I normally hate them are definitely worth splurging on. Okay, I'm gonna share some tank tops with you guys. I have a lot and one bodysuit. Um, one thing that I will do with those is wear a ton of bodysuits, but somehow my, all my bodysuits have gone missing and I just made an order online. So stay tuned for a haul coming soon. I'll just put on like a bodysuit and shorts and call it a day. That's amazing. This bodysuit that I have is from Revolve. I think it's lovers and friends. I can't remember. I'll have it linked down below. I just think that this is super cute, but um, honestly, on a day to day, I'll normally just wear like a really simple black bodysuit or just white, like super simple jewelry, call it a day. My style in the summer is very boring. Like I don't really do much. It's simple. I always say simple jewelry, throw your hair up, that's it, you know? But anyways, I really do like this bodysuit. I feel like sometimes it can look boxy, sometimes it can't, sometimes it doesn't, and I just think it's super cute, so. Okay, I have a lot of tank tops to show you guys, and I just wanted to share them to give you guys some reference. So I do have these misguided tank tops, which are so many times that I like need a new one, I've worn it out, there's a string hanging from it. This one is from misguided, it's kind of just like the perfect cut. Um, I would love tank tops like this, just in a better quality, but I feel like I will just ruin them. I'll, I feel like I'll ruin a white one, you know? Next black one I have is just misguided. This one is super, super cropped and I didn't really, I don't know, I didn't realize how cropped it would be when I ordered them online. So I normally will throw these on on top of like a sports bra with like some stuff I'll show you guys soon. So this I don't really wear on its own unless I'm home by myself or something. Uh, but still it's good to have, especially if you like throw it on over a swimsuit or whatever that might be. And then I have that same tank top just in white. This tank top is also misguided. It's a white cropped. I have messed this one up so much. You can't really see the stains on it, but like, <laughs> you know. Um, I don't love this material as much, but just to give you an idea of what the kind of tank tops that I wear. I really just need to invest in some good ones, guys. I really want some like athleisure wear tank tops as well. Not with that I would say that, you know? And then this one is from Princess Polly. I wish that this was smaller. It's definitely a little big. This is a US 6 and I feel like it's kind of um, boxy as well, which I don't always love boxy, but with the right look, I really do love these and it's just like a really good staple to have. So I will have that link down below. And I normally do have a Princess Polly code. If I do, I'll have it in the description, I'll look. I also have some t-shirts that I love. Guys, this is seriously so upsetting, but I have like the perfect just white t-shirt from Outdoor Voices and I got a coffee stain on it right here. So I'm gonna try to bleach this. This is just the perfect boxy, slightly cropped white tee. You can throw it on, you can wear it with so many things. You can throw it on on top of like athleisure wear. You can wear it with like denim shorts, whatever that might be. It's really great material, it's super soft. I love this one, I feel like a lot of my white um, t-shirts get like super dingy like these are just pretty much absolutely trash like, this is like an Urban Outfitters one but it's just so messed up right now I'm not even gonna try these on and then this one is just so messed up but for some like that is just like not even white at this point um, so I just wanted to show you how much better the Outdoor Voices one was and you know it probably has to do with my like washing skills I will have other like white crop tops that I've loved and gotten a lot of use out of link down below as well because it's like Obviously, you always need a t-shirt to just be able to throw on. And I really like boxy cropped over like a tight fitted one like this because the second you walk outside, you're sweating. Now onto my favorite part of the video. Um, actually, every single piece of athleisure wear besides like one, I think, is from Outdoor Voices that I would just wear on a day to day um, as far as like this heat goes. Okay, so I personally love a two-piece set, like biker shorts, a sports bra, I think that's so cute. I just ordered a bunch off of Girlfriend Collective, which I'm really excited for, so those will be coming. Um, but I'm trying to show you guys things that I don't show you all the time in videos. I have these biker shorts from Aloe. They're a size small. I honestly wish I would have done a size medium in them, but they are the best quality. They're so thick. They hug you in the right places. They're really flattering and they're definitely worth the splurge. I love these with a black sports bra or I really want a good athleisure wear like black tank top because I think this is actually perfect. Absolutely perfect for the heat. I don't know exactly which line this is. 
it's the new one from After Voices, um, but this is the softest thing they've ever come out with. I buy stuff from them all the time and this is like the softest thing. So these shorts are in a size medium. I normally like neutrals, but they do a lot of colors and um, I love this. I think it's super, super cute. So really flattering, really soft, really comfortable, and most importantly, very light. So you don't feel like you're wearing a whole fitted layer of like legging. And then um, this little sports bra and then the back is open. Super cute, love this look. The next thing guys, this is like one of my favorite things ever. And if you buy anything from this video, this is what you need. It's the exercise dress. It is worth the investment. It's one of those things that you will have forever and you will wear forever. And it's very like breadwinning housewife vibes, you know? I actually dress like a tennis player, so I'm gonna start playing tennis, but I have this exercise dress. Oh my gosh, guys, it is so cute. I got it in a size small. I would even maybe go extra small on this. I think it's so cute. It just is a little bit baggier on my um, stomach sometimes, so I would maybe get an extra small. I have a ton of different colors of this, so I want every single color. I really want the white. Um, they even have this like lilac color that's so pretty, but it is so lightweight. It is so comfortable. It is the best cross because you guys know me. I love dresses and I love athleisure wear, so it's like exactly what I want. And it's just the best. Like, oh, you're not gonna sweat in this. You feel amazing. You can do anything. 10 out of 10 Dr. Man. I literally cannot recommend this dress enough. Okay, these are my favorite biker shorts from Outro Voices. Ugh, it's so hard to find them on the website, but I will do my best and link them down below. They, I believe they're like a seven inch, five inch. I don't know. I'm so bad at this, but these are really, really flattering. I love them. I think they're so cute. They're so great to work out in. They're so great to just like wear around. This would probably be my, like my second favorite. I've honestly worn these non-stop the past few months. It is okay, last thing, I just got this and I'm really excited. So I have the exercise score. I love that and I cannot believe that I actually don't have that with me right now, but it's okay because I feel like I've really covered the athleisure wear. The exercise score from Outdoor Voices is super cute and then they also have the court score. Oh my gosh, guys, it is so amazing. I wore it the other day and underneath you guys can see the spandex and then the actual sport. So it looks like you're just, you know, off to the play some tennis. Again, kind of turn it into a fake two-piece set, wear a black top. Um, you can wear this to actually work out in. You can wear this to, like grab coffee with your mask when you're social distancing, like whatever you're doing. I just think that this is so cute and it is perfect for the heat. So 10 out of 10 would recommend. All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I hope you are all surviving the heat as I am barely, but I love you guys so much. If you guys liked this video, let me know what other videos you guys wanna see down below. Comment 1111 if you guys made it to the end of the video. I love you guys so much. Subscribe if you guys are new here and I will see you soon. Bye.